having a new renewable energy source can really make a big impact on our planet because we know climate change is here and now. We need to bring government, academia and industry together to solve this grand challenge. The situation is an emergency. We need to act really quickly. As someone who just loves the ocean, loves the environment, it's really important to me that my day-to-day -day is spent making a difference on this global challenge. The ocean is a key new source of energy. 70% of the Earth is covered by ocean. It's so powerful, it's so consistent. Unlike a lot of renewables, it's there day and night. Carnegie Clean Energy is a technology company looking at the physics of the waves and trying to work out how best we can extract energy from them. We've developed a technology called CETO, which converts ocean waves into electricity to make the world more sustainable. There's some fundamental challenges with wave energy. It's been around for a long time, but it is particularly difficult because the motion of the ocean is really complex. The big challenge is really to extract as much energy from each wave passing as possible. We've been working with HPE through their Cray supercomputing, and more recently we've had access to AI uh, and specifically reinforcement learning experts. The addition of reinforcement learning to our CETO controller gives it the ability to self-learn. And AI is really changing the game in that respect because it can see what's coming, it can adapt continually. Literally every wave passes, it learns more about how to extract energy from the, the next wave, allowing us to process data at the edge in real time. It's really quite a revolutionary technology. And we need to scale that solution to as much of the world as we can. Right now, wave energy is really in its infancy. In the future, there's no reason why it can't power large coastal communities or whole islands. There's really no limit.